it's going to be dealing with the weeds. That's, yeah. What kind yeah. of weeds do you mostly have in here? Um, we'll go up. We, uh, we have a lot. <laughs> um, <laughs> at this time of year, we get hassles with uh, winter grasses. Um, that doesn't sound like a real issue, but it is. Like, you know, winter grasses can be... Because they're a pain in the butt. They, ha they have runners and yeah. they produce well, a lot they, of seed. Yeah. And they don't actually interfere with the growing. And if it wasn't for quarantine, we probably wouldn't care that much. It's a, they're a fairly inoffensive thing. But with quarantine, we can't have winter grasses either. Mm -hmm. um, then in the summers, we have mellows, um, vetches. And Datura. Yeah, datura. Um, mm. And those are... There's even a little bit of oxalis up there. Yeah. Those are usually compaction. So have you ever taken a penetrometer and looked at what the compaction is it in these soils? down to where the soil is prepared to, where we've been. Because uh, we had to rotary hoe after every, uh, mm. every crop. Mm-hmm. The, the, the only sort of, yeah, we, what we tend to do over the summer is that we bring in just straw. It's the only sort of uh, organic material. Occasionally we manage to sneak a green crop in, but it's not very often. Uh, so what we try to do is, to compensate is just keep putting straw in and working it into the ground. Mm -hmm. um, during, the, during the winter, we can't do it now because it doesn't, just doesn't break down. We can't get it, we can't plant through it. We can't. It's right. just too you hard to work it. Don't have the fungal component no, to do we're that just, decomposition. Yeah. We're, you know, yeah. we're putting it down and we're rotary hoeing and, the, you know, it, and now it's also more difficult to prepare the ground because we're always struggling a little bit you know, with soils a bit too moist, even in here, because our turnaround times are quite... Uh, you know, we're, 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 in other houses where we were planting, we're virtually picking there and we're planting there. So it's it's yeah. tricky with uh, preparing the soils with without damaging them we, too much. We do work with some of the largest um, flower, cut flower growers um, in the world. Oh, yeah. um, Astro Farms out of Saudi Arabia. Yeah. And uh, a lot of the flowers coming into Amsterdam. And we've started working with all of their greenhouse production. Mm -hmm. And basically, it took a little while to get deal with the weeds. But yeah. that, was the really, that was the only tricky part. And what we really had to do was to um, deal with their bed um, and, and that whole production system because we've got to get um, structure rebuilt in that soil down below that compaction zone. And every time you come in and rotary hoe, you're imposing a really significant compaction problem on that soil down however deep your rotary hoe is going. We, and we so run rippers through as well. Yeah. Yep. And so still, it's, it's mainly there's... There. There's a compaction zone. Yeah, there's a compaction zone, and, and let's get rid of it by getting that biology in. So after you finish with a crop, mm -hmm. this last time, if we can come through, and when you rotary hoe or when you go in and deep rip, um, mm -hmm. let's get the biology injected, put down as deep as you possibly can. So I'd like to deep rip one last yeah. time, if that would yeah. be possible. And using either compost or compost tea, whichever is least expensive for you to mm. get hold of and have enough yeah. to put the proper biology on. And then we need to take a look at the soil and do a soil food web mm. assessment. I'm sure you've got chemistries on this soil, so you can just hand us one of the chemistries that you've, also, that you've already done. Mm. Yep. And then we'll really be able to guide you on exactly what the compost and or tea Re is required for the system to as rapidly as possible get rid of the compaction, get rid of the conditions that are selecting for all the weeds that you just yeah. went through that list. Yeah. They're, all of them that I know are there because of the compaction. Okay. And that's what's selecting for them. Oh, yeah. So we'll select more for this crop.